The AMR9 is an extremely good SMG, but it's difficult to use if you got the wrong build. So today I got the Pro Player AMR9 and oh my days, this thing is nasty. Ladies and gents, I have so many good builds for the AMR9. So I was like, okay, let's do the Pro Player build. But this thing isn't that good in like regular multiplayer pro like rank play matches. So don't use it in those unless you're a maniac and you want to try to compete against like the rival with this thing. Other than that, this thing is very good in like Warzone, regular public matches. It's just a little bit iffy in the ranked play that being said what the pro players were using was the buffer tube this is because the sprint to fire speed on this thing is absolute ow absolutely horrendous it takes a long time when you're sprinting to actually fire the gun making it not that good but if you add the buffer too that's going to bring up the sprint of fire speed by so much as you guys can see then we also can move around the map a little bit quicker we can strafe quicker overall the gun is going to be a lot lighter allowing you to really move around the map but the recoil control is going to be absolutely murder there is no control on the gun now it's going to be bouncing around like crazy but if you hit the first shot it's actually going to be pretty easy to use so to make this thing a little bit easier to also to use there was a horn there's a massive parade outside st patrick's day parade so you want to use the amr9 enforcer long barrel this is going to maximize that damage range and add a lot of recoil control basically bringing up the cons that we are getting with the buffer tube as well as you know making the gun a little bit better as you guys can see we are losing a little bit more sprint fire speed and our ads speed which is annoying and i do have another very good build for this weapon i feel like you guys won't like the pro player build keep in mind this is pro player for warzone still works great in War, I mean, in multiplayer, you guys will see what I mean. Overall, though, right now we got a lot of mobility, we got a lot of range, so you can literally beam people across the map, and then you're still gonna have so much mobility, making it actually very, very nasty. So, from here, this is where things get a little bit weird. You might think we're gonna add a little bit more recoil control, but we're just gonna maximize the mobility so that that sprint to fire speed isn't as bad. So, I'm gonna be adding the DR6 hand stuff. This can allow us to strafe quicker, we can move around the map quicker. Overall, it's kind of like that buffer too. We're just gonna be able to cruise around the map and just be able to do everything a lot better now when we're going to the firing range you guys are going to see this thing still bounces around a little bit you got to get used to this setup once you're used to it that's when you're going to really see the power behind it because we have mobility and so much range right there you guys can see me beam him up to medium range still is bouncing around a lot let me know in the comments do you like the iron sights on the amber nine or do you like to run a sight for me i i think you kind of need a sight like you don't always need it but i feel like you're a little bit more consistent with the sight so jack glasses i really like this but don't run it on the smgs i think it's a little bit too big that's what she said overall i think you guys will do a lot better if you run the slate reflector or the mk3 reflector wherever that is in the gameplay i believe i'm running the um the slate reflector doesn't really matter you guys can run whatever you want the pro i got this from was running the slate as you can see there's a little bit of recoil but if you hit the first shot in your gunfight then aim assist is going to help you control the gun keyboard and mouse it should just be overall easy to control with the mouse and so now mobility and range from here really personal preference you guys can add whatever you want it does not matter what you add you don't really need a laser if you are going to add one add the solar flare it's going to bring up that sprint to fire speed by a lot if you're going to run a muzzle jack bfb so good on this thing but it is going to make the ads speed a little bit slower but it does make the gun very easy to use so i feel like a lot of you guys are probably gonna like the jack bfb and um just, just so you guys know i'm not trying to make this confusing main part of the build is the barrel and the stock and the optic the rest doesn't really matter i'm just giving you some variation so you can build it based off of your liking suppressors are a little bit tough to use with the weapon what i would use instead if you want to be a little bit off the radar then i would use the compensated flash hider still gonna be a little bit of recoil on the weapon but you're not gonna be on the radar as long and it, it really does help out the gun overall though i'm not gonna be running a muzzle uh stay away from the ammo if you want more recoil control without really hurting mobility you can honestly just add the sock and zx grip another great one's going to be the phantom this one's going to bring up the sprint of fire speed by a ton i have a previous build that's exactly like this one we got the phantom and it is very very good up close Keep in mind, there's a little bit of recoil on the weapon. Overall, what the pro players in Warzone are rocking is this build right here. There's a couple other variations, but this is one of the pro builds, if that makes sense. Since there isn't just like one best build in the game. This one's got our range. We got the mobility. Now, if you guys want another very good build that, you know, say you're using that pro build and you're like, I just don't really like it and you want to use something else. Try out this one right here. I think it's basically the same build. Yeah, try out this one. This one's a little bit easier to use. And then uh, here's the, oh, no, this one 
one's great this one has a suppressor so if you want to use a suppressor try out this one ADS speeds a little oh that one only brings it down by seven percent that's not too bad this build right here is pretty crazy and then if you want to use this thing with the double barrel in my opinion this is like the best double barrel one and then um if you want some more builds look on the channel i got so many builds for the amr9 you just got to go through them and find the one that's best for your liking since not every build not everyone's gonna like every build since everyone plays differently this is a great secondary this thing helped me get the mgbs got some crazy games that you do not want to miss oh my god it's scavenger cover eud field upgrades trophy you guys see the rest let's get into the game place yo ladies and gents we got the amr9 this thing's a little bit awkward to use oh my god these guys are cruising this thing's a little bit awkward to use at the beginning but once you get used to it you realize like how much power this thing has like it has a little bit of recoil but as long as you hit first shot you're fine Bro, these guys are cruising. I don't think they know how to play domination. <laughs> Man just ran past the B flag to get the, the A flag. I don't think my teammates are doing anything. I don't think they're non-existent. I mean, I don't think they're existent. I got to do everything. Teammates, I need you to take your head out of your ass and start to move. Come on. Don't, don't make me wish I was on the other team. Oh, you got melee? F*** you. Boy, this pistol is amazing. I love this pistol. Okay, my teammates are actually brain dead. I have an EMP. And I, was, I don't think my teammates have gotten one kill. We got the advanced UV now. There we go. Bro, I gotta focus way, way more than usual. What, what, what the f*** is going on? I'm in, like, new territory. New COD territory. Why'd he even pick up that gun? You know, me missing the nade actually helped out by so much. my aim or nine well this is about to be a pistol nuke ah! no dude three off the nuke it's always the melees every single time bro what is this lobby this is like i just landed on a new planet i don't even know what's going on Bro, if I had my ammo 9, I would have been fine. It was just the reloads take so long, and then everyone has a melee. Fuck, dude. Oh my god, I almost had that. And the guy was like, no, you're going down. I'm hunting you down. Damn it, dude. Bro, I was going to be so happy. Okay, well, if you're seeing this, we probably popped off again, so. Oh, my tinnitus is acting up. I'm starting to get the rings in my ears. That, that thing is so annoying. Recently... I've been getting so much tinnitus, but it's like, it appears and then goes away. The worst it was for like a week, and it was like constant, where it's actually hard to sleep. But then that went away, and so then I turned up my headset again. But then it came back for some reason, I don't know why. Where am I getting stunned from? What is happening right now? what the fuck okay we got emp oh i'm so happy now and then we're gonna do the advanced uv see like there's a little bit of recoil on the gun when you hit the first shots that's when you see the power because you have so much mobility but then a lot of damage range bro you know what i should do actually okay so the actual class like i was saying in the class that is a hundred round mag on here that's what i need to do 100 round mag on this and just spawn trap them let's just see the mobility is not that good you know a little bit slower bro Fido, you're my favorite streak in the world wait i don't think these guys want c flag they, they only try to capture a they don't want b flag or c flag
Well, that guy's a assassin. Bro, this is pissing me off. I just gotta remember. I've been trying to switch this for like over a week and I still forget to to hold the reload. No, oh, I didn't realize they're still spawning behind me. Bro, that guy with the throwing knife? No. No, okay, okay. I need to put my anger away and transition that into COD skill. <laughs> So much PTSD from those knifers. So the knifers are the best players in the entire world. Nothing can stop them. Okay. So there's still enemies on the other team. Just the spawns are a little bit weird right now. Next game, I think I'm going to go to like a big map just so you guys can see this thing at range. So the melody, okay. I think it's because the bunch of enemies that aren't going for the flags, but they're just going for kills. And so it's making the spawns very like wonky and it's like unreadable in a way. That was nasty. Bro, can you guys move? something I want to tell you guys, but I got to get the nuke first. And I know they're looking into here. I'm just trying to look at the radar. Making sure I have control of the map. I don't die from any weird angles. Make sure the melee guy doesn't come out of nowhere. Okay, we're on 25 again. I swear to God. Twenty nine, please. There we go. There's the MGB. Oh my god. Okay, the thing I wanted to tell you guys. So, I basically live. No, so I live central downtown in the city I live in, which the city's not like that big. I think we have like half a million people here, so it's not like, you know, it's not super tiny, but not like huge. And so I live right in the heart of downtown. And what's going on today? It's the St. Patrick's Day Parade, but it kind of looks like a meet and greet as well. And so I got like a bunch of people directly below my uh, my window. So I look down, then there's people dancing. We got the parade going and everything. It's so funny. Bro, I'm so happy we got the nuke. Let's go, dude. Let's fucking go. We got the nuke. We got the nuke. We're so much better than these guys, and they're so awkward. Maybe they like, uh, no, I don't think they adjusted anything. It's just this, this match feels so different. I just feel like they're like in front of me, on the left of me, behind of me, above me, below me, they're just baloney. Bro, okay, you know what, Drip? You know what, Drip, you motherfucker? MGB. Let's go, boys. Let's fucking go. I mean, let's flipping go. We can't, we can't be squared. Bro, every single stream I have, it gets age-restricted. It's so bad. And then it starts getting, like, promoted to more people and things, so I gotta be family-friendly. What the flip, man? Let's go. Easy MGBs. We don't miss. We only hit. Let's go, 126 kills. So, what happened there, boys? What happened? You, you let me drop a nuke? Yeah, you guys couldn't that's stop crazy. the nuke? That's the trait. That's the craziest one. Yeah, hey, I appreciate you, Jen. Bad. GG's. That's right. That's crazy. CBAS on YouTube. Hello, hello, hello. There we go, boys. There we go. Oh, you're immediately in the corner. Bro spawned in, saw the nearest corner, and went there. Okay, right now, it is so loud out. Because of the parade, there's like honks and horns of everything. Like, 
I, I, I feel like I gotta go board the Titanic. And so if you hear anything in the background, it's because of that. Also, if you are curious, join my Discord. I put a video in there of like what I'm looking at, basically. Okay, buddy, you gotta calm down. Oh my god, that was the Taliban. Oh, I can't lay down. I can't lay down. There's times in this game where you try to lay down and the game's like, nah, no, you're, no, you, you're not going to lay down right now. Come on. That's funny. Okay, I don't mean to sit in the corners. There's a lot of enemies. Got a lot of kills. Got men with RPGs. Or female. It could be a female. Don't cancel me. We're doing the advanced UAV. We can advance like fuck them. Okay, wait. You know what? Holger. Holger it is. What the fuck? Who sees these iron sights and is like, yep, that's what I'm using. These iron sights are the best. Well, honestly, I think the pistol's better than that. You see that? AR would not do that. Okay, I'm gonna call in the VTL, get some map control. I like when they all try to, like, shoot it down, and then I can just kill them as they try to shoot it down. I gotta stay away from there because the VTL is gonna kill me. Remember, you gotta hit first shot with this thing or else it's like you're gonna miss every other shot. Wait, I only have four shots? Wait, knife? Was this STB? Bro, model for two guns? Okay, whoever's using this prop to you. Bro, they got like Eminem playing outside. What the fuck? Bro, teammate, you're giving me so much PTSD from just being knifed in the past. Yo, STB actually. Wait, wait a minute. No, yeah, this thing's ass. I, was, I thought it felt good for a second. Absolutely not. Friendly UAV on station. Okay, at close range, it feels good. Long range, this is the shakiest build I've ever used. No! Why do you spawn in my ass? Okay, I, I still can get the nuke. But that is insane to be three off a nuke and the guy's right there. Maybe he was already there, but that's in fuck, Bro, okay, I couldn't imagine like not having a nuke and then like you're about to get your first nuke and that's what happens. Which is why it's sometimes it's good to play like slow or like hug the edges, but you don't want to play too slow because like the way that you were playing is the way that you got there. <sighs> the sneezes are coming back. I can't sneeze. I need to stop the sneeze. No. Nope. No sneeze. Ah, uh, itchy nose, allergies, springtime. Ah. No, 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 no. I am not going over there. Nope, they're all in the back. They don't know how to play the game. Ah! Oh, that was a cluster fucking a half. Maybe even three fourths. We got the VTOL? All that work for our VTOL? I gotta assert dominance. I gotta actually assert dominance. This makes it so much easier. Because then it gets them out of their spawn. They stop camping as much. Even though I'm in their spawn camping. Bro, my allergies are horrible. 
I got a runny nose right now. Bro, everything's itchy. What is happening to me? I feel like I got to put the controller down to go blow my nose. I don't have any ammo. A sniper? No. That's the last thing I wanted. Striker? Fuck it. Wait, no, I still use the AMR9. I forgot. Okay, we have ammo. No, not this fucking Holger again. No, not the Holger. Okay, we got the advanced UV. No! C4! Nobody uses C... That was the guy with the Holger? Yo, okay, you guys think I'm not going to get a nuke, but watch. We are so close right now. We are so close to a nuke. They're all EMP'd. I'm going to put them in a blender right now. Fastest nuke you guys have ever seen. Teammate, fuck off! I need this nuke! Oh, okay. You know what? Looks like we're not going to get the nuke on this one, but let's see how many kills we get. Usually, I would have, like, two nukes in every video, but there's a big parade outside, and I died 28. I, I was on a 28 kill streak, and so that pissed me off, and so this is the gameplay that you guys get. Sorry if you guys don't like it. There's a big parade outside. I can't even hear what's going on. I don't know if the mic's picking it up, but it's very hard to focus when there's hunks and the Titanic is on my front door. Still going crazy though. Still going absolutely insane. Bro, I keep dead sliding. Those dead slides? That's what pisses you off the most. More than anything in the game. Is when you go to slide and your guy just dead slides. Yo, 87 kills. Not too shabby. I'll see you guys in the next one.